For as long as I live, I think I'm going to love the experience of flying. Not just because this gives me an excuse to overlay some b-roll footage of my trip this weekend, but I love sitting in a plane above the clouds. I love the fact that we can travel so far so fast. I love being able to sit above the clouds. But I also like looking over the landscape and seeing the logic that we have imposed upon the world. The way roads are interconnected and the way that we've adapted our life around rivers and bodies of water. How streets get laid out. Sometimes when you are in the minutia of things, when you're down looking at the fine details, you can really get lost in all of those details and you can lose that greater perspective. This weekend I was sent by work to Ottawa for an accreditation board meeting. I sat in as an observer to listen as the board went through their business and made recommendations. And one of the sections that they talked about was evaluating their own processes. Because sometimes when you're implementing policies or you're going through your procedures and you get bogged down in just how you operationalize everything, you don't stop to really think and take a really high level view of what is it we're trying to accomplish? What does success look like to us? And are the things that we are doing moving us closer to that goal? Or are we just starting to get hampered down by our own goals and our own objectives and losing sight of that greater perspective. As a group this weekend, we were able to gain further perspective. The president of Engineers Canada told a story of how in the 60s, when all of the deans of education got together, they had one goal in mind. How do we help our students get their licenses when they leave our institutions? How do we help those regulators accredit and ensure that the educational process is good enough across the country so that our students can easily go get their license and become professionals within the industry. At my institution, we get sometimes so focused on ensuring that our curriculum will pass accreditation and that our pedagogy and our methods are all sound that we have to remember that this was set up to ensure that regulators are comfortable with our programs and that our students can have confidence in the education that they'll receive. It's not about the business, it's about serving the greater profession and ensuring that we serve society. And you can only get that view when you take a step back from the day-to-day -day operations and realize there's something at play that's much higher than the tuition and the scheduling of classes and the textbooks and the weekly assignments. And it's in those moments of silence when we're sitting back and just listening to other people that much like sitting in a plane and looking out the window, we get that chance to, to take a step back and take a look at things from a much higher perspective and ask those really critical questions about where are we, what are we doing, but more importantly, where do we want to be? Or where do we want to go? And how do we get there? All in all, it was a great weekend. My boss and I flew to Ottawa, met some great people, and had some wonderful conversations. But I've been in these clothes for like two days, and I think it's time for me to stop rambling at a camera. Thanks for stopping by, and don't forget, stay awesome.